you're getting tired, I think we got a couple more heels in us, okay? Come on. You're a good boy. All right, let's go, man. He likes to follow me. You know, this camera doesn't allow you to appreciate the height of these heels. Uh, but this is extreme Appalachian digging. We're going all the way to the top. Okay, so I think we're gonna go over that way. That looks a little more forgiving. So, all right, let's go, Bravo. I've already fell a couple of times. He's been right there. Checking on me. I don't think we're gonna make it up here, Bravo. It's a little slick. <laughs> go ahead, buddy. See that he won't go without me. He's just that good of a dog. And uh stays very close to me. So very protective too. <sighs> I know. Come on, let's go. I'm going up. I'm going up. You see, he's like, hey, get up here, old man. Get up here, old man. Go ahead, little buddy. He's like, come on, old man, get up here. Ooh, this is a cool rock right here. Look at that. Look at that. Now tell me that wasn't something right there. He's sitting right in it, though. Come on, Bravo, watch out. That looks like a rock. That. Man went around like a cistern. This almost looks like a little cistern right here. And I'm getting an iron signal right here, so. Okay, well, no, it's not an iron signal. It's a 22 bullet casing. All right, I'll pack it out of here. Probably some, something that my son shot up here. Whew. They like to come up here and shoot. But that looked pretty old though. I don't have kids that old. All right, folks, keep. I guess so I do. I guess I got one that's 28. Eh, well, I'm getting old. I guess it's better than the uh, the the alternative. <laughs> All right, folks, keep watching on digging history. We're going to hit this area right here. This looks like a place where we might find something. If we do, we'll be right back. <laughs> 